This man is not exactly resurrecting people. He's recreating the sounds of people and things that were once imprinted onto old gramophone recordings. Indiana University professor Patrick Feaster can often be found scouring dusty library shelves far from the public eye. The discs themselves disappeared more than a century ago, but Feaster works with rare pictures of those discs. I've been taking images of sound recordings printed on paper in ink and converting them back into sound just as though they were playable discs or cylinders or other media that we slap onto turntables, play on phonographs and so on. Feaster's research has turned up what are believed to be the oldest recordings ever made by humans. This recording, Der Hanshu, appears to be the oldest gramophone recording we can listen to today. Just how old? This recording was made in Germany in 1890 by a 90-year-old army general, a man who was born in the late 18th century. So in that sense, it's the earliest ancestor of all the vintage vinyl that anybody has ever tried to play. It's the basis for a lot of cinema, anything pre-recorded for television, radio, and so forth. It's the whole idea of the pre-recorded action, the pre-recorded performance started with the phonograph. So if we want to understand how people first worked out how to deal with that possibility and actually made it meaningful, the phonograph is where we have to find it out. Reporting from Indiana University, I'm Mike Pfeiffer.